Hey, real estate agents. Today, I just want to do a brief connection with you on driving people around. Make sure if you go to work for your company that you check their policy on driving buyers and or customers, clients around in your car because usually they require extra additional insurance on your vehicle. The other thing is I've just made it a policy not to drive people around because People have small children, they have different types of car seats that they need, they smoke, there's other safety issues. So my best in profession practice is that I tell somebody I'm happy to show you six houses in you know, a day's time, bring some snacks, bring some drinks to hydrate yourself, and you can certainly follow me or I can give you a map on which houses we're going to see first and how we're going to get there. So you can communicate that way. But overall, I would say that it's up to you whether or not you want to follow your state guidelines slash company guidelines on whatever you want to do for driving people around. But I would always suggest that perhaps you have a, you know, think about the policy as far as kids and smoking and food in your vehicle and other things like that. So it's probably best that they can talk about the different houses together and the privacy of their own car and that they don't have your ears listening as well. So I uh, hope that makes sense and happy driving.